before each work I, I there's a little meditation you know I'm asked you know there for all the people who have left um, please you know help <laughs> come into me <laughs> and um, they've been very responsive so actually I can tell you I, I did a painting a long time ago about a geisha and I didn't know much about geisha but I did read quite a bit the geisha, the painting actually woke me up in the middle of the night said give me a blue moth, a blue silk moth and it was so strong that I had to get up and I painted um, because she was just you know, showing her, hand, her hands or gloves and I painted a blue moth and later I find out that actually geisha um, in public shouldn't show their hands so there's something about very surreal about about art I think I think you know we are connected with one another but we also we also are connected with the people who have departed I guess and and I, and I really um, I really think that very strongly I love the newspaper as a medium so much that I decided, especially the antique newspaper, that, that I add the stories all in the back. And sometimes they are not the main, the main direct thread, you know, of the, of the painting, but they have a, such a muted colors. Um, and why it's antique newspaper? Because it seems that um, he actually, for a medium, it's, it stays uh, it stays very well uh, onto the canvas. And my favorite part, sometimes, of the newspaper is um, little ads, and they are absolutely phenomenal because uh, they tell something about the person who put the ad, whatever the ad is, it's matrimonial or or. Um, uh, somebody looking for an apartment and, and some those places some some of those places do not exist anymore so it's, it's quite fascinating